It is 642 everybody. It sounded too good to be true. And unfortunately it was. Consumer expert Hank Winchester is here with an important warning about a costly scam. Good morning. This new scam, it involves gift cards. This morning, you're going to hear from a Gross Point Woods woman. She is out almost $1,200. She is sharing her story so you too don't get taken. It all starts with a phone call. It was sounded so good. This Gross Point Woods woman who asked us to conceal her identity said a man called her saying he was from a federal bank. He told her all she had to do was spend a few hundred dollars on iTunes gift cards and she would receive a $9,000 grant she could spend any way she liked. They take the gift card that you've just bought for whatever that dollar amount is. They're going to request the number on the back of the gift card and then they're going to drain that gift card. But you will never see that grant money. Our victim lost more than $1,200. I cried for the first two days because my rent got to be paid and I don't want to be evicted. And it's not fair to me. Why me? People fall prey because they want to be lucky. So for those who think they've been the victim of this scam. If it sounds too good to be true or you're suspicious, please call us at BBB. We'll be more than happy to walk you through the process. And that's the key. If it sounds too good to be true, just hang up because some people have seen what the scam can do. Don't do it. Don't do it because they will scam you out of every penny that you have. And we have more information about this latest scam and also the scams affecting Metro Detroiters right now. You'll find all that information on the consumer page of our website. Click on Detroit.com. I'm Hank Winchester. Help me, Hank.